Oh, now you should be able to get through the one door, right? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can upgrade the security tuner. I'll leave the room, go right back to the door you initially came through. Go into the hallway of white. No, up the stairs. It's a ladder. Well, now we've both made that fucking mistake. <laughs> oh, whoops. Now, wait, wait, no, not try to do the thing. Oh, yeah, thing. look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Penny! We need you for a skit! I haven't told Zach this yet. Oh, what? We're gonna use Penny for a skit. A pe okay. Administrator writes. It, it will be a while before we hit that skit. So you're, you're good. Requisites is Android at its booth. Yeah, that's I can't. Okay, so now you just gotta go talk to the mandroid. <sighs> go ahead. Let's go save again. My pretty save point. My pretty save point. My pretty save point. It's pretty unimpressive. And now I'm warning down <laughs> the ladder. My pretty save point. I'm gonna die now. Nah, you won't die, <laughs> probably. I don't really need her to behave, Corinne. I just need her to walk on a leash inside of an apartment. Zach's apartment. I highly doubt he's gonna play nice. Oh, okay. Wow. You know, I really assumed that was gonna fold. Hey, buddy. How can I help you? I need a compression cylinder. Components warehouse. Row one, stack B. Follow me. Just keep Follow the him. noise down, okay? Zach, you're supposed to be following him, not walking and staring into his cold, heartless eyes. God, please get away from his eyes! Uh, this is helping. Even he's trying to break your game! This is helping. This is not helping! Okay, you're literally in his way. I hate this! Oh, his eyes are the worst! Come on, bud. Let's go. Let's go. You don't even know who the fuck you are. There might be important trash around. You're right. I need to search for trash. Here we are. Oh god. Your compression <laughs> cylinder will be found at the far end of this room. Thank you, acquisition android. The far end, Zach. Oh wait, wait. Trash! Oh, oh dear, he's dead. Oh, go back to getting trash. Oh, it hurts me too. You motherfucking idiot! I didn't know if it was just bad. Did you just watch the android burst into flames and then go, you know what I should do? Walk exactly where that happened. You know, people make mistakes, face. Yeah, that doesn't make you less of a moron for it. Listen, fucking idiot. We're all fine, bro. We're all fine. You watched, you watched him fine. die, and, and it, it taught you nothing. I was like, oh, it must be bad for synthetics. Bad day for synthetics. Just gonna stare in his eyes again. Please don't. How can I help you? I need you a compression cylinder. Components warehouse. Row one, stack B. Follow me. I like this, like, next walk circle. Circle. Yeah, yeah. Okay. walk circles around him. I do like that he's got earrings. Is this, is this getting you dizzy yet? Oh, I'm now spinning. <laughs> you weren't even walking around him. You're just spinning in circles like an idiot. Ah, good. Yeah. Oh, man, his eyes follow you. I don't like that. Yeah. That's not where we want to go, bud. We want to go this. Where is he going? That is the way you want to oh, go. Oh, right. I knew that. You were not paying any attention. I was staring into his soul. <laughs> I got lost. No, you were staring at what what should be soul. I got lost into his beautiful eyes. Uh, that's a word for it. Uh, in honor of Zach this week, please discuss your stupidest moments thus far, like in the game, in life. Some of my stupidest moments were illegal, so we probably shouldn't go over those. 
statute of limitations has not run out yet. <laughs> Excuse me, Ben. Oh my god, he almost pushed you to death. Oh no. Oh, who could have foreseen that that would kill somebody? Other than me. I thought you were gonna walk into it again. Okay, stupidest moment in life, Zach, go! Was it being born? It Ooh, was. Hurtful. But not uh, accurate. It was when you dropped out of college. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not really. It's like a breathtakingly stupid thing you've done. Hmm. Let me think. Will you go first? Because I'm doing things. Oh, sure. Deflect. I mean, I'll think of something. I mean, there was the there's the DUI. I can talk about that because <laughs> that that Let's was make bad. Make funny ones. Oh, it is funny. It's just sad if you know me. Sad. <laughs> it's only sad. Like the actual story is, but fucking sane. So I went to a party. Uh, don't drink and drive, kids. I went to this party, and I I started doing tequila shots after I was already blitzed. And apparently what happened was some friends of mine were like, we'll give you a ride home. I'm like, cool. I took that as we're leaving now. And what that, oh, there's a butthole. I bet that's where you go. It's, Look, trash inside the butthole. That's how you know. There's a plug in the butthole. <laughs> uh, oh, or it's just a cramped, terrible space. Motherfuck. Uh, just a hidey butthole. So, so I leave said party. And I'm standing outside. And eventually I got tired of waiting. And by eventually, I mean approximately 35 seconds after going outside. So I got in my car. Uh, at some point, I don't know how, I lost a tire. <laughs> I made it home on three wheels. And I went inside and went to bed. And then at another point, and again, I don't know how, I woke up. And was like, oh, I gotta fix that tire thing. Still blacked the fuck out. I remember none of this. I just, I'm just guessing at that. And then I drove down the main street of my hometown on three wheels with sparks flying and shit flying into my mouth. I stopped at a gas station to get a lighter because I wanted the smoke and I didn't fucking have one on me because I left all my shit at the party. And like... Like, they didn't stop me. They just let me buy the lighter and leave on three wheels. <laughs> like, well, this uh, guy seems like he's doing okay. <laughs> exactly! Like, what the fuck? Like, they didn't call the cops, either. They're just like, ah, he's probably fine. Uh, and then... Then I went to a different gas station. Can, oh. We're dumb. I figured it out. And I, uh, I went and got... Uh, a good old-fashioned panic attack. Actually, what is really sad is if you had looked at my, like, Google search history, initially it was like, tires, tire shop, dad, dad sell, dad, 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 because I was the only person I could think of that could fix it. <laughs> and then I started having a full-blown fucking panic in a parking hey. lot, throwing everything out of my trunk. <laughs> and while doing so, the cops pulled up and I went, ah, shit. Jeez. And and then I got arrested, and then I, I I made the cops laugh a little bit. That was nice. Um, <laughs> I was I was handcuffed, sitting on the curb, waiting to go into the jail, Excellent. and the cops standing next to me. And I look at him I'm like, I don't suppose there's a way I could charm my way out of this, is there? <laughs> and he's like, <laughs> No. I'm like, Well, I had to try. I get in. And they get you in, into the shower to change into the jumpsuit, which is just the worst experience. Jumpsuits are terrible. I don't know how women wear rompers. Uh, <laughs> and Crocs. They also give you Crocs, which I feel like was the worst part of jail. The and Crocs are uh, shit. They are not. <laughs> they're even worse when they're prison Crocs. Uh, so I get down to my underwear. Oh, I didn't kill them all. Oh, good. That's great. Get down to my underwear, and I fucking, like, the guy goes, Sir, those two? I'm like, well, don't you just get a show then, and drop my drawers. 
And then uh, he hands me the Crocs, and I slide in there. Like time to slide into my big rubber masturbating shoes, <laughs> which is a Deadpool reference. Which he got. Good for him. But he stared at me <laughs> like, for a really long time. He also was like, I, I hope this guy's talking about Deadpool. Yeah, well, that's the thing. I was like, it's a, it's a Deadpool joke. He's like, no, I get it. It's just like, we don't get a lot of jokes. I'm like, well, what, what else am I going to do? Are you going to arrest me? <laughs> he started laughing. He's like, I, yeah, I guess you got a point. Like, yeah, <laughs> I know. Arrested for terrible comedy. Yeah, no shit. And then uh, I made the booking officer laugh because I leaned over his shoulder after taking my mugshot and went, orange really isn't my color, is it? And then uh, then there was a litany of problems after that. But that's the story of the time Mason went to jail. Enjoy, <laughs> everybody. Hope you, hope you all enjoyed it because I don't want to tell it again. <laughs> uh, oh, other fun fact. I used to show my mugshot on first dates. That's how you separate the weak. Hey, you want to see? You want to see something special? <laughs> no, it's over. I let in. I would lead in with the story about the DUI. I'd try to make it funnier than I just did, and then I would be like, "You want to see my mugshot?" Because I look so like moderately discontented. Ooh, trash! Trash! Got trash. We're good. We got trash. And then the good news is, these days I barely drink, so yeah. it all worked out in the end. I also have a second mortgage now, and I totaled that car. Yeah. Or drink a drive. It's good stories. It's, a, it's an ex it's a it's a life lesson, but it's an expensive life lesson. Although <laughs> this is not justifying it. <laughs> but if it weren't for that, I would not have a computer and we would not be streaming. Yeah. Or an Oculus. I never would have fucking bought an Oculus if I didn't <laughs> have to take out a second mortgage on my house. But I didn't have a license, and I was like, oh my god, get me out of reality, please. <laughs> so yeah, what about you? you? You got a happier one, maybe? <coughs> well, fuck. Yeah, maybe one that doesn't involve us going to jail? Was this the one I went to first? Hold on, sorry. Let me just figure out how to fucking get out of here. No, I, I think I think this is how to get out. I'm pretty sure it is. How it is. Is it going to be right there? Okay, so where do you need to go exactly? Um, I got to go to the elevator. Okay, so you need to go back through the butthole. Wow, it didn't kill any of them. What a useless fucking alien. I think they saw me for a second, but none of them reacted. Because that, that dude definitely pulled his gun. Trying to think if there were like other really stupid moments in my life. I mean, there were, but like, not life lesson ones. Just like really dumb, really things. dumb stupid boy things. Yeah, the game. really dumb stupid boy things that weren't sad. I don't need to bum you guys out with all the sad ones I did, <laughs> or all of my drinking stories. We can forget fucking all of that. I feel like I should have. I feel like they're gonna hear that. Nah. <laughs> oh, what was that noise? Oh, whatever. I don't know. It sounds like the elevator's fine. Oh, I do have one like okay drinking story that is funny. <laughs> uh, so Becca and I went to a local bar, Franklin House, and while we were there, it was all a good oh. time. I wasn't driving, so I got schmammered. And then Becca drove back, and apparently she went in to pee because I wouldn't get out of the car because I was very drunk and sleepy. Ew. Uh... It's like that door scene from Monsters, Inc., but worse. <laughs> Except scary. Um, uh, oh, God. It's just, it's just men in bags. Um, so I... Uh, I, I got out of the car and I fell asleep on a ladder. Like, I was standing up with my head laid on a ladder. When Becca came back out, I was laying on the garage floor. And she's like, Mason, get up. I'm like, fuck you! <laughs> fuck and, you! And she's like, 
if you do not get up, I am going to dump a pitcher of cold water on you. Or no, she goes, get up, and I go, fuck you, and she goes inside, grabs a pitcher of cold water, comes out and says that. And I'm like, dude, bitch, you won't, no balls. <laughs> and boy, if she fucking didn't. <laughs> she dumped a full goddamn gallon of water on my head. <laughs> and it was ice fucking cold. <laughs> and in the middle of winter. <laughs> Ooh. And I shot up. And I'm like, God, Jesus Christ! And she's like, I told you. I'm like, God, still, that's so uncalled for. <laughs> and then, like, I didn't remember any of that. I she told me this later because I woke up the next morning on the couch, still wet, because I hadn't changed. And I was like, Why am I fucking wet? And then I got up and went to the bathroom, and in front of the toilet, <laughs> like I had jumped out of them myself are both my boots perfectly still like I had just been standing there. <laughs> it's the weirdest fucking thing. Can I get someone from Seeks and Synthetics to look at my Android because I work 24 hours a day to help me out with your elevations and I'm the dentist. Please, well, everyone that I moved out of the hospital, no one's telling me anything. If I'm going to be pulling down these kinds of hours, I need to switch the trail. We've got an Android down here with a perfectly adequate program but he's gathering dust because apparently the same models aren't acting up on the other side of the stage. So what the hell's going on with this place? Get someone down here now before I make an official complaint. Brandis. <laughs> Bad file. <laughs> no, 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 Zach. Zach, Zach you gotta do it right. Mm, Bad file. Did you get this one? Mm, that's a bad path. Ooh, two bad paths. <laughs> you guys are oh. uncomfy yet? You should be. No, I'm as comfortable as ever. Oh, I got a dumb story from not me. <laughs> uh, this is from my, my like higher up boss like the lady that runs our entire warehouse uh well two i have two so apparently a lot of people fuck it hey guys I'm sure they would <laughs> a lot of people we have these like glass panes in our break room and a lot of people walk into the glass apparently because i watched Just a man do it he like it wasn't even that clean but he, like, turned around and went to leave the area and <laughs> walked full force, no, like, hesitation, like, face first, full force into a glass pane, and it rang when he hit it. <laughs> it was the f I, he stopped, and we all kind of stared at him, and he's like, none of y'all saw that. But I did see it, Darius. Fuck you. I saw it. We all saw it. I saw, we saw Darius. I'm calling you out. You walked into a glass window. <laughs> I still need a fucking plasma to... torch. And, uh, yeah, so apparently Jody, the lady who runs our warehouse, also has done that. <laughs> and I wish I had seen it, because, God, that would have been funny. All right, <clears throat> tell stupid stories. Stop making me look like the only idiot in the room. Sorry. Um, hold on, give me a second. I gotta go pee. Are you... I'm serious. <laughs> uh, you're doing a bit. All right. <laughs> bye. I'll be right back. I'm sorry. <coughs> uh, stupid stories I have. Ooh, lever. I'll use that in a second. Let's just double check some shit. Is that just gar? Ooh. Eat. Oh, is that say meat? Meat. <laughs> um. Oh, hello. I can't use you. Um. So. The stupid story I have. <clears throat> Sorry. I'm sick if I haven't told you. Um, I distinctly remember. Oh, god damn it. I once, uh, let's see. Oh, hello. In church, I once, uh, like leaving church, I once gave uh, uh, my dad a hug. Or so I thought it was my dad. Uh, it turns out I, I saw a dude in a similar shirt um, and just hugged him from behind because I was like, hey, it's my dad. He looked at me like, what the fuck? And he turned around and I was like, you're not my dad. He was like, no, I'm not. I was like, oh, uh, my bad. <laughs> so, 
fucking... That's not Rona. It's just uh, like a cold or something that's fucking up my throat. Whenever I get a cold, it fucks my throat. And it always happens around this time of year. Um... Well, oh, hello. Uh, let's see. Yes, he does have the Rona, and yes, he is dying. Let's not let's not make the idea that I have the Rona. My parents are already pissed off at me. Uh, How can they be mad at you for not getting the test if your insurance doesn't cover it yet? Uh, because they're upset that my insurance doesn't cover it yet. Well, then they should be mad at your insurance. Yeah, it's you like can't control that. Yeah, like it was after I signed up for it that they're like, you know, that's a kick in until January first, right? I was like, no, I thought it would kick in immediately. Like, no. now, nah. I was like, motherfuck! Yeah. They they can't be mad at you for that. That's just how insurance works. Your dad yeah. doesn't know because he's probably had the company insurance for the last however many years he's been there. <laughs> but I don't know about your mom. I told the story of how one time uh, when Thank I... You. What? Nothing. Sorry. You said reflex. band camp, you dirty bitch. <laughs> yeah, I did. I did. It's a reflex. I can't help it anymore. I can put down here. Uh, it's a ramp, Zach. Only handicapped people can go down it. Oh, no, I need to go down it. You fucking bastard. Oh, those are stairs. Uh, handicapped people can't go down those. Oh, she's dead. To land on station. I told yeah, you we didn't part. hear your message. We understood you would be... Hey. What, guys? Yourself. Ripley. From the Torrens. Relax, kid. She's dead. What the hell is going on here, Marshal? Where's the security forces? You're looking at them. You're looking at them. I've seen the creature. What is it? I don't know. Something brought here by Marlow, the captain of the Anisadora. The ship that found the flight. I sicked it on some people. Is that is okay with you? safe left on this station. That creature's running around. <laughs> ah, some of your people are dead because I made it kill them. Yeah, I threw a, a bomb at them and I laughed as they died. Taylor needs attention. <laughs> They didn't die at all, no I know. We can't take her there. We have a basic life support unit back at HQ. Then let's go. Wow, the don't be a dick about to it. HQ, but it's down. Transit control is upstairs. Samuels says you're an engineer. Go make yourself useful, seeing as you screwed up the trap. Oh. Yeah, right. Oh, we'll I'm sorry. You know, you could have told us, dickhead. Yeah. Ricardo, get a lock on our radio so we can stay in touch. Lock my radio, bitch. Ricardo, you fucking paying any attention? We really should hurry. You didn't do anything! Yeah. Don't worry, Samuels. We'll get her out of here. Yeah, something about the look on her face makes me think she's dead. Oh no, she's moving! She's moving! Step on her real quick. You know I'm what? not sure, Corinne. She asked when we're gonna play so The Sims. Uh, oh, uh, that, that's what I just threw this on her. <laughs> it's a smoke bomb. I won't kill her. But, uh, ah! yeah, stupid thing that I've done is once, where do I need to go first off? I need to go that way. Behind you. Yeah. Uh, one time I was leaving church and I saw a dude, I saw my dad, so I hugged him. Turns out it wasn't my dad. Uh, I just hugged a random stranger that looked like my dad. <laughs> uh, and the, yeah, the dude. Hey, dad, guy. And the dude was like, uh, what the fuck? And what have you been like? Thank you, I needed that. Uh, <laughs> I would have been like even more concerned, like get away from me. Well, I don't mean it in like a creepy way. I mean like just a lonely poor man that doesn't doesn't have anybody. Way. <laughs> you know, in a sad way. Yeah. You know, in the Mason way. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that's one of my stupider moments there. Um, did you? Oh, yeah, break that lock. Yeah, now yeah. just rotate it with any normal wrench. Yep, just need a wrench. Uh, did you tell the story about the time that you made seagulls try to kill you? The geese? Which one was it? Oh, it was seagulls. <laughs> it was seagulls. So... <laughs> When I was young, what my family and I used to do is we would go to Renamax and then, like, uh, assholes, because apparently you're not supposed to do this, uh, we would go to the beach and feed uh, fries to the birds. Uh, and there were geese, and I think it was geese, it was geese. Um, and so we'd feed the geese, 
Well, my little dumbass, instead of throwing it, tried to hand it to it. And that geese did not like it and wanted and like bit my fingers. And I was like, ah, you bitch! And I ran away as far as I could. Flashbang version like, two, baby! And like climbed up my dad and was like, Let, leave me alone! And he was just like, what the fuck did you do? I was like, I pissed it Why off. Why did man. you piss off the geese? Like, now we're gonna be haunted by them. Uh, fun fact Whiskey tried to befriend geese, my dog, the big one. Uh, we went to the beach which wasn't really the beach it's just like the local lake it's just down the street and i like was playing with him and we got this ball for free because a lady's husky dropped it in the water and she didn't notice so and you stole a ball yeah well it I was it around floated about like saying i stole a ball it floated like really far out and the lady like looked at it and was like where's your ball and looks out there and just like waves it off and leaves <laughs> So, it was more of like finders, keepers, losers, weavers, so it's fine. The alien. So, he turned so everything off. Work. Hello? I know someone's in here. Do you? Do you have a gun? Cuz I have a gun. Shoot you. Calm bitch. down in there, you android fuck. That's just rude. Shoot your bitch ass, bro. Uh but yeah, he started swimming toward, like, I threw the ball, and he noticed a bunch of geese floating in the water. And he started swimming towards them to make friends. What the? And... Oh my god! What a perfect shot! Oh, that was flawless! Is the alien coming, or did I just kill a man? No, he just murdered a guy, it's fine. Cool, uh, stole the shit. <laughs> That's a call to mugging gone wrong, kids. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, yeah, so he started swimming towards him, and I got really concerned that I was going to have to kill a bunch of geese because they were attacking my dumbass dog who just <laughs> wants to make friends with everything. He's just like, well, me, me make friend? Me make friend, though. Okay, here, I'll, I'll read chat to you. We took Penny for a walk at night once, and she pulled us over to smell something. After a while, we were like, okay, let's get going, Penny. And we put a flashlight on it and saw that she was nose booping a possum. Follow me, please. Are you pissed off, really? Well, you have a stun baton. Use it. I don't know what it does to him, but find out. Just stab him with it. Oh, you missed! God damn it! Hit him! Why do you stab it? Oh, that works really well. Stab him again! Oh, maybe it's just temporary. Also, that's kind of adorable, Corinne. Like, nope. your dog literally made friends with a possum. She didn't even try to eat it. Just... You leave me alone, you fucking bitch! How's it feel? How does it feel? Okay, and we're gone. Was that all you needed to do? I think I needed to go this way. Oh, I think he killed the shit out of this person. Nah, they're fine. It's just a little blob. That's intestines. Oh, well, maybe, you know what? Hindsight? Might have been a little bit forward on the everything's fine. Wait, wait, I don't think you can get me if I'm in the access terminal. Oh no, he can get me in the access terminal. <laughs> I disagree. Can you die? Can this kill you? Wait, what's behind you? It's his use. What he says use? It was like direct. Die! Oh, EMP mine would probably do it. Don't have the stuff for it. I just had to... Oh, fucking hell. You gotta play the ring around the rosy with an android. Please don't see me. Please don't know where I am. He knows exactly where I am. God damn it. 
God it's damn like, it. Why did you pull out the smoke bomb? I don't know. I don't have any other means of protection. Yeah. Zach, you still have a stun baton. I don't have any charges left. How many charges? I don't have any. I only had four. Oh. So you don't. I uh, I mistook the battery for the lights. So anyway. As the stun baton. Oh, well, there's that. Yeah, that sounds about right. I think I just gotta die. Yeah, I think you just I think you just gotta accept your fate. God damn it. I don't know where I was last saved.